What's up guys and welcome back to another video and today we are going over five of the greatest wrestling video games of all time and let's get straight on the list with number five WWE All-Stars. All-Stars is one of the greatest games because of the unique style the game introduced. It took the arcade style into a whole new level. Everything is super exaggerated and over the top but it makes for a really great time. Seriously, you have so much fun playing this game. There are two game modes in the game, which are both pretty fun. The first game mode is Path of Champions. Basically, Path of Champions is the closest thing to a story mode to the game. You have to go through a certain number of people in order to become champion, and they even have some pretty cool cutscenes. The second game mode is Fantasy Warfare, which consists of 15 matches, and it's a Legends vs. Current Stars matchup. They even have cool promos before the match. Overall, this game is insanely fun and you should really check it out. Number 4, Day of Reckoning 2. Growing up as a kid, I always had a GameCube because, well, it was lit. As a result of this, I got WWE Day of Reckoning 1 and 2, and they were some of the most fun games ever. For the time, the game ran very smoothly. I love the animations that are in the game. Every move feels like it's actually hurting the opponent, and I just love that about it. Anyways, the game has a story mode that is absolutely fantastic. Based off my memory, the story mode was awesome and it was continued from the first day of Reckoning. You actually have to create your own wrestler, so it's kind of like a career mode but with actual stories and like cutscenes. Unlike the newer career modes where it's just mostly matches. I would love to do a walkthrough of it if you guys would be interested. Number 3, WWE Smackdown vs Raw 2007. I think it was going to be obvious that Smackdown vs Raw 07 would be on this list because of my GM mode series. I honestly love this game and I feel like some people underrate it to a degree. The wrestling in this game is very awesome, but the best things about the game are the season mode as well as one of the most loved things ever, GM mode. It depends on if you pick a Raw or Smackdown member, but both stories are pretty fun. And GM mode is just absolutely amazing. For some of you who are not aware, basically GM mode is when you control either Raw or Smackdown and you have to put on a better show in order to win the ratings war with the opposite brand. It's a ton of fun. Also, this game introduced a lot of new match types, such as the Money and Big Ladder match, and even the little crowd fighting area. Number 2, WWE Smackdown, Here Comes the Pain. Now that we are on the final two, I would like to say that personally, these last two on this list are interchangeable. They could go either way. Anyways, Here Comes the Pain is one of the most fun video games I've ever played. Not just wrestling, but literally just video game. Honestly, I can play only Exhibition and have fun because of the variety of match types. The hardcore matches are the most fun out of all of them. You can go and free roam throughout the backstage area. You could even spear someone off of a building, then climb a ladder attached to a helicopter and jump off of that helicopter. Then you also have a great story mode where you make a lot of decisions similar to an RPG game. This is just the recipe for success. And number 1, WWF No Mercy. Many people have been saying that No Mercy is one of, if not the greatest wrestling game of all time. So about 5 years ago, I finally decided to pick up the game to see how it is for myself. When I got it and played it for the first time, at that point I understood why people loved it so much. It is literally amazing. The engine for the late 90s is one of the most impressive things about it. Usually, a wrestling video game around that time is really choppy and has horrible animations. Not this game. It's super smooth and has better move animations than some of the moves in WWE 2K17. Also, the story mode is one of the best story modes in all of wrestling video game history. There are so many different stories and everything can change your story. For example, if you lose a match, you're going to get a totally different story than what would happen if you won that match. The replay value for this game is something we will never see again. And that is it for the video guys, as always, thanks for watching, I hope you all enjoyed, if you did, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe for more, make sure to follow me on Twitter at Valmplana, check out my other channel, Official Life Facts, and I'll see you all later.